Hey everyone! For today's video, I'm doing some character sketching for a pro comic that I'm going to probably work on, I don't know, in a, in a while. Um, it's one I've had bits and pieces for a while, but I don't have, um, I guess a through story to figure out how long or what it's actually going to be. Um, it is mainly about this one. So, ugh. Anyways, so the main character for it is a blacksmith. I'm pretty sure, yeah, that's a distinction between that and then like the farriers are horses. Yeah, blacksmith is the term I'm looking for. I'm pretty sure. <laughs> and she makes like the enchanted weapons that you use in various, you know. Generic enchanted weapons like this. Where do you get your, where do you get your enchanted sword for your gaming, gaming party? So yeah, she's pretty much the one who makes the enchanted weapons that you know, D and D characters or whatever role playing game you're playing. You know, they're the weapons that they use, and she is pretty much in, always annoyed at them. So, th again, it's why I don't quite know how it's going to break up, because in the thoughts for it, I'm pretty much like, okay, so, she makes things, and she is just tired of all the bull that these adventuring parties put her through. Like, no, I can't get you a replacement sword. That last one took three months and some materials that I literally can't get replacements for. So I can't just give you another sword. She's perpetually annoyed that they keep losing and breaking these things that should not be lost or broken. Though I have noticed recently that when I work on designing new characters, they and to have like some form of sleep deprivation built into their character and I'm like, oh, this is a sign. I should get more sleep. <laughs> hey look, I picked up reference pictures. Which didn't end up being that necessary really. But anyways. So that is the basic through line of her character. And again, I'm not quite sure what it would be, because the story for it, like, it could just be, like, her getting sick of all these adventures doing stuff, and Wing Robin's like, no, no, it's not that hard to do it, I'll just go do this quest for you, or whatever. So I don't know if I wanted to do, like, that, and then just be, like, becoming this add-on to, you know, basically D&D &D party unwilling participant in that or more towards like just following her making various things or gathering material materials or something but I'm not sure if that would just more I guess slice of life I have I don't quite know around that feel like when I, I should, should have some form of through plot and an end game. I'm just not quite sure what that would be again. I suppose I could just go with the creation of a weapon of some form through gathering the materials to forge actually forging it to the enchanting process which would work pretty well I suppose and could end it on the weapon going out with an adventuring party and you know, fade, or it'd be like if it was a, like a TV show episode or something. It would fade to the party going out and starting their battle, faded to black. Doesn't matter how this battle ends, all dramatic like. <laughs> I, <su> I, <laughs> I really need to stop saying I suppose. Oh, and also for this video, I decided to try 
adding in a little bit of audio editing, which I'm very bad at. Though I have started cutting out a lot of um, wells and 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 so and etc etc. I started cutting those out mostly when my audio rambling goes over and I need to get rid of like 30 seconds and be like let's see I don't need that gap and oh look there's me starting over my own words I'll just get rid of those I suppose I could so yeah I'm gonna try editing some more than usual and adding some undertone music or background music it's background music that's the word I'm looking for is background music so it should be a little more pleasant to listen to, maybe. Um, her design, actually, like some the basis for it was from what well, was originally a mechanic character. I had some sketches for years ago, and while the story that she was attached to, I didn't like at all. I liked some of the some of the bits of design, the oversized goggles and the hair pretty much. I went with those and pulled them through. Made her outfit much more practical. And yeah, that is about it. Uh, as usual, I have links to all of my social media and stuff below. And if you liked this video, you know, like, share, subscribe, I feel like I should say, but I never do. Um, anyways, 